There's not much that can outlive the legacy of the Zora, but can a hero of their own kind actually be the one to finally save Hyrule? I know Sidon was looking for a Hylian to save them, but maybe this time one of their own could be the key to finally do so. So by only picking up their weapons and armor and nothing else, is it then possible to get through and beat Breath of the Wild? The rules to the run are simple. 1. All Divine Beasts and the Finale must be cleared. 2. Only Zora weapons and gear can be equipped. 3. The Terror of the Zora, the Lionel of Plymouth Mountain, must be exterminated. 4. Mifa's Grace is the only champion ability that can be used. And 5. Force mandatory items like the Vicet are still okay, as the run would be impossible without them. Although Zora weaponry and spears are quite plentiful around their home region, their significantly low damage outputs make them quite weak against all enemies and bosses that lie ahead, which Master Mode and its region doesn't help with at all. But with enough astute planning and tactful weapon usage, I'm sure we can prevail in the adventure ahead. This is gonna be really exciting, and without further delay, I hope you all enjoy the Zora only run. Woo! Okay. Plateau done. Now we can make a beeline to uh, Zora's domain. So I'm pretty excited. I think first thing for us is to uh, get ourselves a horse so we can make it there faster. It'll be very quiet this time. Let's go in. Yep, just like that. No! What? Why does it not want me to do that? Get back here, horse. No! No! You don't get to get away with this. Come on, get him. I don't care. We're getting him. Yes, right there. Stuck on the tree. He wasn't getting away. <laughs> Blocked by the tree. Could have easily avoided. It's okay, mean no harm. He's a four stamina, yes. Okay, this should make our adventure a lot easier. Blue horse, Zora horse, yes. We're gonna stop for this uh, Korok here though. We definitely need a few Korok seeds because there's gonna be a lot of Zora weapons right away. Nice, that's a four strength, three speed, four stamina. Well, there's some good horse stats, okay. Okay, name for the horse. Well, in honor of um, the fish people. Then... Oh, we're out of letters. I was going to name it Stealth Fin because it looked like a Stealth Fin Trout. Like, I don't know. Um, what's another fish? Wait. Hyrule Bass. <laughs> Hyrule Bass. Yes. Okay. This this is good enough. Just a slightly different color. Hyrule Bass. Let's go. And... Oh, wow. Yeah. It's Master Mode. They're not going to be easy. <laughs> okay. Has to. Maraca time. Don't have proper Zora weapons, but... Bombs away! Yeah! Wait. Close enough. Boop. Get that one. Yep. Bye-bye. And get him. See, it's okay. These are uh, a Zoro weapon in spirits. Bonk. And that was so close. There we go. They all died. Okay. <laughs> Just landed on the raft. <laughs> this is a scapegoat. That one better than expected. You can upgrade this weapon stash. There we go. It's nine weapons. 10 slots, already two full rows, so this will be helpful. Now we'll head up and actually make it to the swamp outside Lanero. Goat! Beep beep! Bonk. <laughs> we'll just register the shrine for the warp point when we come back to use the fairy fountain to upgrade our gear later on. Which is the same reason we're going to be getting some uh, Lizzle kills and uh, going to be doing some fishing. Gotta get some Hyrule bass. Sorry, horse. I gotta capture your kind for this one. Okay, that's a shrine. And that's the one we need to enter for uh, our first Zora weapon. Got a fish bowl. It's a, it's a fishing tutorial for later. Oop, and we failed. Push button. Awesome. <laughs> down the hatch. Should be able to go down here, and there is our chest. And in the chest is our silver longsword. First Zora weapon. This is a really nice one. I just love the curving on it and just everything, pretty much. It just looks badass. Design-wise, definitely my favorite Zora weapon. And we're starting out with it, so <laughs> nice. And for whatever reason, that's just break dancing on the button. <laughs> Just infinitely, I guess. Oh, it's not stopping for whatever reason. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. Uh, <laughs> woo. <laughs> okay, just one of Hyrule's greatest mysteries. Oh boy. Uh, oh boy, oh boy. <laughs> Guardian already. Okay, he's not the smartest. Kronos time. Just make your own cover. He's very confused. We're just dancing around the pillars. He can't see me. Uh, Jinx. <laughs> Ah, no! <laughs> Lizzle tail whipped. Okay, I'm just trying to get to the domain. We should have brought our horse! <laughs> <laughs> we should have brought Hyrule Bass. This is not good. Ah, oh, we got the tree. <laughs> oh, that's a Hinox. Ah, I thought we were clear. This is why we scarfed on random food. <laughs> of 
course, the stealth barrel is right here. Oh my god, he's... <laughs> what? <laughs> you just walked through the whole water. He can do that? You take the barrel. I don't want it. Oh, I know. He's <laughs> gonna kick it into me. I know he can go that far. Oh, nope. <laughs> just keep rolling into the next enemy right away. Oh, of course he saw me. You know what? Plan B. There's a spear, but... We see elevation. Oh, wow. That's a <laughs> silver guy. Woo! I'm gonna be taking this chest, don't mind me. <laughs> he, he really minds, but hey, we got a silver bow. Yes, our first Zora bow here. <laughs> uh, now we just get away quickly. Bye-bye. Get that tower now. Oh, and there's a boulder that just disappeared. Um, okay. Thank you for not crushing me to death. Just a lot of chaos happened today. We're just uh, trying to get away from it. <laughs> it's a good start. You know what? Lots of Zora weapons ahead. And what is that you're holding? Looks very Zora-like to me. Oh, pfft. they always miss, so come and charge me, blue guy. There we go. And a few good whacks. Okay, you know what? Not very strong. <laughs> we'll, we'll be taking this, though. Oh, no. Let me take it before he does. Before it falls. And you did this. Okay. Wax for you. And bow shot. Boop. Yeah, we did it. Baseball. Nope, that didn't work. Boop. <laughs> Got him out of the way. Can't leave our treasures down there. We need to use them. Zora Spear. There we go. These look cool. I like the angle tip. Uh, only do nine damage, but, you know, it's another weapon. We're going to be picking up a lot of these, probably. Ah! I hope he jumped off his platform. <gasps> no, we died! I'm not going up the hill! Are you serious? Oh, that's painful. Okay. Go to your happies. <gasps> no, not again! Are you serious? Oh, let's be more careful this time. They all run so fast! Oh my god! See, this is why we die here. Take the chest. Right off here. That's good. And the chest is a silver scale spear, but it's long throw. No! Out of all the modifiers we could have gotten. Okay, there's going to be a lot of Zora weapons on the road ahead. But if you would like to follow along with the exact locations for all of them in the world, like my other runs, I have made a full map and key of all the types and locations for each. Most of them are within the confines of the Lanero region, but a few of them also lie outside of it in random spots across Hyrule. So I'll save these two maps for download in the description below. But with this in mind, making your way to Zora's domain to collect all the respawnable ones will be your best option, to hopefully provide enough firepower for the fights ahead, including including the grueling fights against the Lionel. <laughs> He's got the rock. Oh, I'll take the rupee. Thank you. Very nice of you to give me that. Mm, run. <laughs> Go. <laughs> okay, we're dodging him. Oh, there's arrows. There's a lot of everything. We just accidentally dodged that. Okay, give me arrows. That's what I want. Thank you. Taking that. Okay. Whoop. And that's a Zora Spear with durability up. Okay, that's nice. Thank you. It's not a long throw, so anything beats that at this point. <laughs> oh, wow. These are sharpshooters. It's a zigzag. Wow, that was close. Gotten pretty good at the art of dodging Octoroks here. Whoop. Had to just barely turn in at the last second. Woo. Take him out. Perfect. We're going to be taking all this stuff because we, we need it for the Zora armor. And, you know, arrows are nice. And this should be a... Zora Sword with attack up 12? Oh, wow, that's actually really good. Uh, yes, please. Thank you. Okay. Didn't expect that to be my immediate weapon here. They're pretty cool looking. There is just so many around these parts. Thank you, Master Mode, for once, I'm thinking of. A silver shield with durability. Yes. Okay. That fits really nicely. We got the bow, the shield. Yeah. It just complements everything. We're very shiny. Now we're going to heal up so we stop shining red. Okay. I wonder what this could be. Could it be another Zora weapon? There's just so many. Which I am okay with. An attack up silver bolt. Attack up 11. Wow. That's nice. I'll always take the attack up stuff over like everything. Silver bow. Just a normal one, but more is better because we have three silver bows. A silver shield. A good selection of weapons. Coming into another camp though. Oh, there's a Zora spear. Yeah, you know, I will take that. Thank you. That's a freebie. <laughs> that's a lot of shock. Oh, that's a lot of random climb. Uh, we're flying fish now. Boop. Oh, no, not the bridge. Anything that could have blocked us. The bridge was just that little... Uh, ooh. There's the domain. But a little wind bomb won't hurt. 
No, oh, just barely hurt. Okay. Uh, almost smacked ourselves, but we got it. Yes. My weapons match so nicely too. The aesthetic is evening out. And it's only gonna get better once we get the Zora armor. Here we go. And there is our Zora armor. Wow, it looks really good, especially with all this. Uh, very nice. And even the shorts fit perfectly. Like, honestly, like, it actually fits, like, insanely well with this outfit. This in itself kind of looks like a complete set, like, a swimsuit version of the actual Zora armor. Get at least 20. We'll get way more. We're getting them all after we kill this dude. But while we're in town, of course, we're going to stock up on our weapons because we're here. Oh, we got it. Okay. Give me my spear. Yes, another one. Basic spear, but effective spear. Let's go back. Oh, <gasps> a beam? No, not the beam. No. There we go. Okay. Nice and simple pad in. Whew. <laughs> Our real reward is going to the back and getting another longsword. So we have two of them now. And yeah, almost full in these slots. Just right here. Just laying right here. We have a sword and shield. So that's really helpful. Um, oh, well, there we go. There's one in the water. See, it's uh, technically better than the last one because it doesn't have long throw. Yeah, long throw is yucky. It just makes weapons worse. I think our bow, oh, there's our bow. Okay, they're just kind of laying around. So very easy to mess. Just hidden off to the side. That is a silver shield. Good, we needed another one. So we have quite a bit of things now. Three shields, so that's pretty good. Almost a full thing of bows and a full thing of weapons. So nice diversity, a few swords, a lot of spears. Yeah, this is really nice. Okay, I think we're all set. So now with all this weaponry, we can finally go up the mountain to the Lionel area and actually slay him this time. No running around, just getting arrows. We're gonna kill him for good. Let's see how this goes. Oh boy. <laughs> Judging by everything else, I don't know. Give a good shot. There we go, okay. The altered arrow gravity is kind of nice. Perfect, okay. I think that guy has something we need though. So I will take it. That's silver with durability. Okay. Aha. The shock arrows. These lead the way. We're not taking a picture because we don't have the camera room. So uh, we'll have to do that at a later time to get the pants. All right. Doing this without pants. We just got the minimalist Zora aesthetic going on. This will be enough for this. Okay. That was... Uh, hmm, we get a redo. Uh, oh boy. Yep, redo. No, not off guard this time. <laughs> We're gonna get him. Gotta melt him. Go up. And just lay it into him. Shots. Head. Boom. Ready a nice chip in there. Woohoo! He's flying up for that. Okay. Not gonna let him uh, prevail this time. Just like that. Got the strat. Oh, a lot of stamina. Oh, wow. No attack food. But we're going for it. Oh. <laughs> Gotta get him every time. Oh, the sweep and attack? No. <laughs> I'm gonna sweep you with my shield first. I'm so happy we have this 27 damage sword. It's laying it into him pretty good. He's almost at halfway. Oh, he just kicked me. I don't know how we're beaming him like this. Oh, okay. This is the run phase. We're not good against that one. There we go. Just bow shots. Attack him on his back. It literally doesn't take up any weapon durability this way. This is so nice. We can keep just keep doing it. Oh, not breaking our shield. Getting the parries. As long as you get the parries, line up the headshot. Uh, I think we'll be fine. Oh, let's go. Only a few more. Oh, it's badly damaged. That's okay. We expected to lose a bit on this. Oh, okay. We almost got the head. Okay. Yes. Come on. We're so close. We're so insanely close. Oh, it's broken. Okay. We have plenty though. Oh, we actually got that. That that could have been it. Come on. Just a few more. He's only at a sliver. Yes, we did it. We actually did it. First go. Basically first go. Pretty much. We're not counting to pass fail, but technically, but I don't care. We did it. That's all I care about. Oh my God. Wow. For a Lionel hoof, a Lionel horn, and the pride that we did it because we can't pick those up in a Zora run. That makes me very sad and upset, but you know what? It's okay, because now we can actually get the shock arrows uh, without fail. Shock arrow, yes. Yeah. There we go. Oh, what the? There was three in that tree. There's, there's occasional ones up high. Yep, they're all in just very odd spaces. There we go. We have the 20 shock arrows, but there's still so many more to grab. We can actually do it in the safety of uh, this Lionel free zone. 
You know, that really begs the question, why is there just so many shock arrows in trees? Like, Valenal is doing target practice, you know, honestly, that could be it, to be fair. Ooh, we have 28 of them? Yeah. <laughs> Not that we need all 28, but we're getting them. And a lizard, too, apparently. <laughs> just chilling by the shock. Just hates trees with the passion, that's why they're there. The mystery will never be fully solved, but we have 33 shock arrows, so let's go. You know, the Lionel is a real challenge. This is kind of like the micro challenge after it, so I think we'll be fine. Enough shock arrows? We have plenty, Zidon. If I could give you some, I would, but yeah, I don't want to kill you. I'm the only Zora that can handle this stuff, apparently, so... Okay, <laughs> just shatter them all. Easy target practice. This is just a bigger, stupider Lionel, pretty much. That should be nice. And then like that. And that one, too. Boom, bop, easy done. <laughs> okay, we did it once again. After the Lionel is gonna seem pretty trivial. We deserved it. I don't know how we got that Lionel fight after all those stupid deaths today. Gonna crank this up and before we get the main terminal. Ni nice try. Shoot down the eye. Oh, shoot on him first, then the eye. Baseball, a double. We looking flashy though, just in the light. Wow. Sorry, I still can't get over the look of the set. Let's go hop on our Ferris wheel here. Ah! <laughs> okay, good. Saw that coming. Oh, okay. All the terminals. Awesome. Now we can face off Water Blight. You know, it's appropriate that we're avenging the Zoras first. Avenge them from the Lionel. Now we're going to avenge Mipha from the Blight. Whatever. Oh, he covered his eye. Whoop. Awesome. Give him the beat down. Yeah. A good spinny. Yeah, this is, this is pretty cake. <laughs> Come on. Give him eye shot distance. Oh, and he always covers his eye after that first one. But we got him, so it's okay. <laughs> Gonna be an easy squashing here. There we go. So the one part I don't appreciate about this. He always covers it, and the flurry is like impossible. So we're gonna do our own flurry with the bow. There we go, and shoot him out of the sky. Yeah, you flipped around. Awesome. Yeah, that was good. Yes. Yes, Mipa. Couple good eye shots. The third one. There we go. Oh, we're out of stamina though. Come on. Not that much. Badly damaged and the long sword. Come on, we got this. A few more. No, it's gonna be just a little too. Yep. Oh, we we missed we messed it up really bad. Oh, that, that did some damage. Woo! Okay, that could have been really bad. Not right at the end. Oh no. Okay. We have only a couple arrows left. There you go. Now's my chance. We're not messing this up this time. Get back here. One more hit. Just... No, I did a dumb hit. <gasps> oh, I'm trying to do a finisher. No. No! Yeah! Midair! That's what I was trying to do. Woo! We got that midair slice. That helm splitter. Oh my god, that was great. Almost got us there. You know, I was a little worried. Burned through a bit of arrows, but it was water blight, so... I'm fine with that. I'm just fine that he's gone, so. Our first stop after um, defeating Water Blight would be to actually get the full Zora look. So to get the Zora legs, you need to do a quest where you need to talk to her, but you need the camera rune first because he has to take a picture of a Lionel. Uh, we don't have the camera rune, so that's going to be our first uh, big step. So we'll have to go all the way to Hateno for that, just for the pants. But in the meantime, yeah, we can quickly get the hood, though. Going up these waterfalls. I still love this a lot. <laughs> I'm so happy the Zora set actually has, like, unique properties to it that aren't just like a buff. Hello. Boop. Bonk. And nope. I'm the faster draw. And yeah, we need uh, more arrows too. But luckily, these guys pretty much always drop arrows, either five or 10. Only the Zoros demand those Alphos. They're all special like that. Right here. Oh, come on. I got that. There we go. Annoying, but he had a stack next to him. We're replenishing, but here we are. And oh, just right there, actually. Well, conveniently placed. And Lock it from the bottom. The Zor Helm, there we go. Some extra swim speed and uh, the spin attack. That's not very practical, but there we go. It's a, it's a funny looking hood. We look more fish-like. But yeah, with three parts, uh, your swim speed is doubled from normal. Boop in the head. Good bonus damage. And break it. Yeah. Boop. Okay, bye-bye. Give me arrows. Yeah, 10 arrows. It's so good. These guys drop a lot. All right, before we finally make it to Hateno, though, um, I will be scanning in the Mifo Amiibo. So, hopefully get something kind of fun. Just kills fish. Nice amount of fish, which we need. 
and we get Azor Spear, but with critical hit. So that's that's kind of nice. I'll take it. The one nice thing about getting a white modifier is that it can be critical hit. So for Spears, it's actually the worst one because you're only getting the double damage on the final hit of the five, but it's still better than that. I don't know, long throw. So enhance away. We can do that. And uh, yeah, we need just three horns, which luckily we got plenty of the horns from the Lizzles we just killed. There we go. Okay. And five for that too. So 10 defense in total. I think for the next one, we're going to need um, some more of those and also some Hyrule Bass. So speaking of Hyrule Bass though, Hyrule Bass, he's back. Blue armor, bluish weapons, bluish horse. I'm not uh, super excited for what follows because taking the blue flame up to the tech lab is going to be a bit of a pain. <laughs> it's a random horse. Hey, a very random horse. Why are you not on your horse? I need to buff my set. Wait a second. Wait a second. That's not right. Pretty sure they're not supposed to be like that. <laughs> you do your thing. <laughs> you hit him off to the side. <laughs> That's so amazing. Okay. Uh, see you next time, bud. But now we're here in a Tenno, and uh, I'm sorry for speaking so harshly. Please enjoy this apology egg. Yes, <laughs> the apology egg. It's not a pass through the chicken coop without getting the apology egg first. Okay, but here's the fire. And yeah, we don't have any sort of wood weapon. So basically have to carry it on our bow like that and make shots. It's going to be tricky. <laughs> it's going to be pretty tricky. Bow game. Pretty strong. Okay. Yes. <laughs> ah, make up for it. Get a better one. Yes. Okay, that's good. <laughs> Starting more fires. If we fail these shots, it's arson time. <laughs> You're right about that. Oh, no arson time. Awesome. Get a bit of a closer shot when I can. Yeah, there we go. Okay. It's nice with the silver bow because the arrow gravity rate um, is a little bit lower than normal. It slightly disobeys gravity, which is kind of nice. There we go. That's easier. But the other ones won't be as, <laughs> as easy here. Yeah, this is the tricky part. That's all the way there and we are all the way uh well, here so let's try to figure this one out um all or nothing yeah why not Boop. just like that and oh i feel like we were so close there come on get it get it get it no we're definitely a little bit too low what if i try it by horse i didn't even think of that to be honest there we go we got it okay just like that yeah we still actually need a get it fully. Yeah, we can definitely get a much bigger gallop going before we shoot it off. Oh, oh come on. You did it before. <laughs> the fire is being aerophobic. I see. Nope. This time the horses. There we go. Got it. And just run it across and it start it's raining. Okay. Oh my god. Why does it have to rain? <laughs> there we go. Go, go, go. There we go. And... Did it not get it? It was so bright, I couldn't tell. Yep. Hey, it went right through it. Look at that. It just didn't want us to get that. It really didn't. That's unfair. That is so unfair. I feel like mechanically the flame went out uh, before it did visually. Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. Just like that. All we can do. Come on, get it, get it. Yeah, we got it. Oh, the long shot. We still got it. <gasps> yes. Okay. Finishing this one off. Nope. And torch is there. Awesome. Yeah, we got the Cameroon. Click. Snap. Don't worry, I'm going to take the sun shrooms too. Or the one. <laughs> That's such a weird staircase. Like, the way Link climbs up it, it just like... It's as if there's other steps in between. Like, you're just literally like walking on the sky. That's funny. We have the rune. Now we just got to wait for a blood moon for the Lionel to respawn. But until then, you know what? We're going to make progress towards the next Divine Beast. Uh... We'll hit whatever's close to home. So the closest one will be Divine Beast Varudania. So been to the spicy zone, but I think we'll be able to manage. Let's get some potions, stock up, and uh, be on our way. Fireproof lizards alone won't be enough. We need the butterflies, which Beetle sells at the stable over here and the one that's in Northern Akala. Oh, there's Hestu. Yeah, while we're here, we can get another slot. Weapon stash, just three, awesome. Yeah, Hyrule base. I just killed my horse's cousins, oops. So from this beetle, we can buy some smothering butterflies. Uh, three for ten each only. We've seen a few more. It's peaceful. I kind of like it like that. Just in this area, <laughs> that fish just uh, got elevated. Here it is. Open it up, and we have silver bow. Yes, we did need another one. Yeah, we have four again, so that's pretty nice. Kick it, stub our toe, 
just to get another silver boat. Yeah, okay. <laughs> and get our final reward, which is a silver shield. We'll pay our little fee, 500 rupees. Yeah. Okay. Enhance away. Five bass, five uh, of the lizzle parts. There we go, five to eight, more defense. Okay, nice. I'll take it. I'm beefing ourselves up. What have you got? You must have the smothering butterflies I need. So thank you. I will take them all. Nice place to start our climb and to pick up those uh, initial potions. Just the level ones so we can make it our way up to the city. You are who we need to talk to for temporary potions. At least three we should bring. Okay, I'll take one. We're mad dashing this one. Six minutes, that's plenty. Let's not regret this decision. Let's go fast. Hyrule Bass, let's go. Oh, there's the Guardian. Whoop. Uh, reset arrow. <laughs> he just spazzes out, that's fine. Better you than me. Oh, he doesn't see us. Bye, Mr. Guardian. Oh, never mind. Woo. Well, they do call them Guardian Stalkers for a reason. Let's have to bomb our way up. Just like that. <laughs> Avoid that Guardian, like entirely. <laughs> he wow, that laser stayed on me pretty well through that. Is he actually gonna fire it? He is, wow, okay. That laser vision. I love how we're just going to the volcanic areas as a fish. You know, a water thing. There's a lot of lizards in the mine. Let's literally pick up any rock, get a lizard. There we go, free lizards. A lot of free lizards here. Gotta quickly find this cooking pot. Where is it? There it is. Flame guard descended. Uh, before we burn up, let's go cook some uh, stuff. Yeah, one lizard, three butterflies, and I think a tail would work. Let's put that all in there. 18 minutes? Oh boy, that's awesome. Let's do it again, yes. That, that's really good. Okay, 13, yeah, that, that first one critical. Um, I don't even think we need it anymore. Chug one down, go on our way. We are now fireproof for a very long time. Holy hotness. Oh, uh, the rocks, no. What are you doing? Oh, oh my god, it broke open, it broke open the drill shaft cave. Yes, R Rudania, that was amazing. Pay our respects though, and move on. Another time drill shaft. It wanted to be free. <laughs> There's those guys with, yep, the enemy drill shaft. Hello. I gotta take these guys down. Come on, ah, oh, no flurry. Okay, one at a time, drill shaft guy is gonna be a little bit harder. He's got the OP weapon here. Do a scale beat down. Oh, got a bull? Yeah, okay. Ah, oh, we died in the fire. Woo! Gonna casually pinch this guy too. Yeah. Oh, that lineup's so nice. Spear versus spear. Whoa, nice. It broke on it, but that's good. Oh, barely does any damage just for these two guys. Just charge us up. Yeah, he has a lot of health. Oh, wow. No, we almost got him. Kick me for the finale there. Boop. Arrows are nice, though. Yeah, these Zora Spirits aren't really the strongest, especially against a lot of them, but we'll still manage because we have numbers on our side. Push and crush. Nice. Bullers always block his path. Get him out. Come on, Yonwoo can easily do this. He's big and strong. Why do I have to always push the boulders? There we go. <laughs> Bombs do the trick. Boop. Hit him. Bonk. The one guy who named their horse Yonwoo, so it always says Yonwoo can't hear you. Oh no. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, what's that? Is that the blood moon in the horizon? It is. Yes. That means we can get our pants. Well, after this divine beast, I guess. It'll be our reward for finishing. Can't hear me. Just follow. I didn't go too far. Maybe I did, actually. Yeah, I did. Yeah. You know, Bo. Hello, Moblin. Boop. One hit. Uh oh, wait a second. It's gonna come back. The blood moon. Uh. Yep. <laughs> the first one. Oh well. Quick and simple death. Again. Come on. Wave, wave, wave. Get over here. Yeah. <laughs> Woo. Oh, pff, just crushed all the gemstones. Oh, wait, back up. This one we can avoid. We're just gonna go up there, actually. <gasps> that was close. That was really close. Ah. Mm. Yeah. All good, right? Uh, there. And there. Oh, that one only half killed him. There we go. Fully killed. Very good. Launch time. Boop. <laughs> Instant. Yes. Shoot him over. Yeah, after that past torch stuff, there's nothing. Easy. Just run them all across like that. And it is right there. Nice. 
start with the easiest ones here. Ah, a little too far off. Very good. Hop on across, and we get it. Just barely touched the malice. So this is going to be the fire carrying segment. So, done this plenty of times before without a wood weapon. Just hold it like that, shoot it, that. Make sure to pick up the arrow. Just like that, over and over again. Not as stylish as doing a trick shot, but it's a lot more effective. And we can actually do it here, uh, this way. Where is it? It is right there. Yep, that's a much easier torch to hit. What, one more bomb. It's like that. Yeah, okay, nice. Bombs coming in handy there. Okay, that's good. Made it nice and safely. And that's the last terminal. There's your center area. Click it, and... Alright, take on Fire Blight. <laughs> Pantsless still, but the pants will be the reward. Uh, we got this. Quick arrow to Stager. Then the bomb method. Knock him down, yes. So he's everything we got in him. Good chip damage. Final hit for the spear. Good. Use cheap Zora Spears for now. These are expendable. Bombs for you. The bomb delivery method's pretty nice. Just two bombs. Knocks him off his ass. And then uh, a few good charges. We can do even more. First phase is going to be a cakewalk. Just a phase to break all my weapons, though. There we go. Broke another Zora Spear. <laughs> wow. Yeah, that's fine for now. Uh, there we go. Burst them out of there. Okay. <laughs> Bonus hits. As long as you don't let him regen, this will be a quick fight. Right by the bomb? Okay. Dropped off a present. And followed up with... Oh, the other bomb was back there. We can't do it. Crap. Now he's going to fly. That's what we're trying to avoid. But we got a good shot. No. Another one. We don't have too many arrows. No. <laughs> Only when we miss the bomb, it gets dangerous. Oh. Last arrow. Couple more. Oh. Zero Spear broke. We're going to finish him off with... Go with the Longsword. Screw it. No. Big. Yes! Big hits. No! Don't fall. You weren't allowed to do that. Kick Ant does nothing. Okay. Got to use our final arrow. That's all we got. Yep. Right there. Smack him down. And... No! No, 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 no. 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 That was a fairy. <laughs> we were so close. I thought we got it. Right there. Oh, come on. We got him with the bomb of midair. Come on. That's it. We got him with the bombs. Oh, that was so good. Oh, that was so, so good. Yes. The bomb hits. We had no more arrows. Excuse my poor planning on that one, but you know what? So good. So, so good. Gives us a fifth one. That's awesome. So we can get our actual true reward now. Just up there. He is waiting. Back home ready, though. What do we have here? Lionel with his bow drawn on me. I think we're gonna teleport away. Nice safari, but uh, I'm fleeing immediately. <laughs> but at long last, we have the Zora that can give us our pants. Very shocking. <laughs> Not very dignified at all, it's okay. And now we get pants. Yes, Zora pants. <gasps> oh, finally, that took too long, but it's okay. We already had the Zora shorts, but now we have Zora pants. Yeah, the full look. <laughs> Okay, it complements everything really nicely, though. Just the silver, just all throughout. With this, we can finally go to the last two regions. Uh, the bird and the zap Zab camel. So, we'll go to those. Then finally take down Ganon. Sizzlefin trout will be very good for uh, the cold area. There we go. The sword and shield respond. So, that's nice. We can't even pick up the shield yet. Uh, yeah, we only have four slots for that. Those are very expendable. But, you know, the more the better. There we go. Silver bow. Okay, got the silver scale spear again. That'll be helpful. Slightly better one. But I think we can do even better. There it is. Look at this guy. The ceremonial trident. 14 damage, so nice step up. Uh, more durable. Yeah. Okay. Be a leeway to getting the actual version later on. So we'll save that one for the finale, though. It looks so good with this. Yes. There you go. Easy archer. Whoop. <laughs> that's That's pretty good. What? Okay, there it is. The loot was just a little late to the party there. Bird. What? It's all spawning in late. Why? Take out this one at least. Yeah. Oh, stealth strike. Forgot those exist. But arrows, 10 of them. Nice. These guys are nice too. Yeah. Oh, he's died of one headshot. Oh, and goodbye to the loot, I guess. And the arrows. Silver shield that we don't need again. <laughs> Uh, last couple of arrows. 
Dr. Shroom, so they stay on the platform. Very not so good. Okay. Oh. There we go. Nice. Well, we're going down there anyways. Silver Longsword. It has long throw though. No, why? Why are we being cursed this playthrough? Ah, okay. We dropping. Okay, there we go. <laughs> that wasn't that bad of a fall. Well, I mean, we can do this last shrine to get uh, another partial wheel of stamina. So that'll be very helpful for Meadow and Windblight. Get our arrows. 10, nice. Okay. Yeah, so Meadow first, then Boris. It's going to be a bit tricky because the Blights will scale. So we'll be fighting Thunderblight with 2000 HP again. But uh, we can manage. Mm, take horse. Hyrule Bass. Yes. No need to face him. Just got outrun like every single one. Shoot your friend. Yeah, I shot him. <laughs> I lined that up perfectly. They never give up. We always take a route straight through Hyrule Field every single time, but it's fine. Hyrule Bass is very helpful. Don't shoot bombs at me. I'm pretty sure they're bomb ones. They are bomb ones. They're all bomb ones on these bridges. I hate that. We're going to start this quest just for the extra rupees. The dude just gives you 500, so yeah. <laughs> and yeah, I'll take your entire stock, Beetle. <laughs> Thank you. And yeah, some peppers right there. Can mix that with the coal resistant stuff for an even better effect. Because we need at least level two. Okay, nice right over, and you can see it right from the distance. Okay, Meadow. And Windblight, we're coming for you. Ooh, they're looking. Not like they're gonna hit. <laughs> they always mess. Boop. Bop them down. <laughs> Straight down the cliffside. There's the salmon. Yeah, no. Come here, fishy. Yeah, salmon. <laughs> Gotta get my salmons. Just collecting all the fish, appropriately so. Ooh, statue. Four spirit orbs, stamina. That'll be so nice for bullet times because you gotta get three eye shots in a row for Windblight to knock them down and only having the fifth of wheel doesn't help as much. Uh, two fifths though, it's a lot more helpful. Ooh, sun shrooms, like always. Buy them all out. Yeah, I'll take the arrows too. Over a hundred, yeah, we're fine. So a little bit of chef time now. We'll go one of these, the sun shroom, and then <laughs> load it up with the peppers. And that should give us a nice, 12 minute, 30 second one? Okay, that's a lot of time. Sizzlefin, peppers, and a sunshroom for another one. Just for some added duration in there. 10 minutes, you know, I think we'll be good. That's over 20 minutes for this whole section, which is plenty of time. Metal's pretty fast. We're not gonna get this, are we? Yeah, we are, okay. Fly fishing time. I call this a fish fly. Okay, cold air, we gotta do something about that. Let's just eat our 12 and a half minute right away. Okay. I like how it looks like a whole, like, uh, little city up there. Try using the bomb rune? That's not gonna work, is it? I don't think the bomb rune's gonna work against these. Oh my god, the bomb rune works! What? The bomb rune actually works? What? That is... That is amazing. Not very practical, but amazing. Yeah. You gotta be very close. They'll probably do more damage once they're upgraded, which these are not. Okay, that's good enough. Bomb time. Yeah, only needed one bomb. All that to save one bomb, but that was so cool. I never knew that, holy crap. Uh, like that, okay. No, oh, what? Oh, come on, you gotta be kidding me. <laughs> At least it caught me. It had the courtesy of that. Go upwards, come on, that's just enough, okay. Quick bop around. Ow, we're dying. <laughs> Ow, come on. Came at me right away. Die. <laughs> Bow's broken, we use another. 15 bow. Just fly on through. I always take this route now. There we go. Suck this right in. It's easy. From here, we just go down below. That's too easy, honestly. <laughs> this beast takes seconds. I don't think I've taken that route before, but I just found it and that was nice. Nice shot into the eye. Oh, a nice shot into the eye. I mean, a nice shot into the eye. <laughs> there we go. This is uh, pretty fast. Ooh. More flying fish time. Three minutes and 12 seconds till uh, we run out. Just of this one though. Okay, this is time. Wind blight. Gotta get some good arrow hits. I'm gonna take the Gus. Ah, no, got too close. Whoa. Oh my God. Okay. Yeah, that's good. One, two, and three. We don't run out of stamina this time, so we actually have enough time to hit him. A few spins here. It's not insane damage, but it's pretty nice. You know, I'm happy we didn't do a wind blight last. Otherwise, it'll be a huge bullet sponge without the attack up. A few spinnies here. This is a long throw one, so I'm just trying to get rid of it. There we go. Oh, he's high up, and I hate when he teleports away. He just gets time to regen. You're cheating. He's regening a lot. 
Ah. Triple arrow. Oh, he fell off. Okay. So much for getting extra damage. Whatever we just took off from him, uh, he regained back. Hit it now. Got it. Yeah. Just hitting him everywhere. Already badly damaged. Okay. Where'd he go? What? He's keep teleporting everywhere. No. Quit moving. There we go. We got the other one. Uh, long throw. Put to good use. Yeah. Thank you, long throw. Okay. Simple eye hit. No. Why? Only on master mode. No gun. <laughs> ah. He's just an annoying one. Nope. And a couple spear hits. Come on. <laughs> Almost ball throw a tornado at me again. Nope. I learned from the first time. Oh, he's got the weird uh, things now. We're just stopping regen. Ah. Laser field. Oh. How did we dodge all of them? Oh, what? How did we dodge all of them? I have no idea. Oh, we got our chance. There we go. Oh, nice barrage. Not bad at all. Thank you, Burb. Oh, pull resistance is running out. Uh, take care of that. Ten minutes, we're fine. Where is he, though? Where is he? I don't see him. Just, oh, there it is. Just randomly in just the corner of the beast. Regening everything back from halfway. Oh, good. We stopped the regen. There we go. Stop him. I don't care. Needs heavy stopping power this time. Good. Come on. Okay, it broke already. Wow. Oh, come on. <laughs> Making disappointing plays on me. There we go. Use critical hit. Just for like a couple extra damage per volley. It's gonna go laser mode on me. Aw, oh, come on. What? <laughs> I thought we had that one. I really thought we had that one. Oh, he's so far. He is so far. Ah, gotta get good shots. Not that that's easy in any way. Ah, take it. No! <laughs> it's all doing a lot of damage. I don't appreciate any of it, Windblight. This isn't your time to shine anymore, though. That spear hits. What's he doing? Little charge attack. Nothing bad. I'm in your blind spot. <laughs> Gonna get me there. And now we can get you here, right? Come on. Close, close. Yes, we did it. Oh, crap. Oh, my God. I thought he was going to teleport away again. He was actually being nice that time. Wow, oh, thank you. <laughs> you trying to use a power attack. I was just right under him. He found that window and we took him down. <laughs> He took a lot of our weapons down, though, that's for sure. Uh, let's see how this plays out for the last two bosses. Um, oh, boy. Well, with Meadow out of the way, we only have one more, which is easily the hardest, but I feel like we're going prepared. So next, we'll charge Naboris. Let's go ahead and teleport to there, do the Gerudo route. We're going to nab a horse down here. This will be temporary Zora horse. Oop. I'll take you. No, don't run from me. I saved you. That's not how he sees it, apparently. Hopefully, Hyrule Bass doesn't feel betrayed. <laughs> More rolling boulders. I think I pass those. Here, I'm gonna entrust you with this bomb. Move boulders. This is partial animal cruelty, but it's working. Come on, get through. Get through. Push, push. You got it. Yeah. Uh, come on. Yes, we actually got it. <laughs> the strong might of this horse. I wanna see a strength stat. New horse, only one strength. What? Where are the hidden stars? He just moved all those boulders. That was a very long trot into the desert. And then just like, nope. Bye bye. Okay. Horse over. Now it's desert time. Yeah, I forgot. We still need to buy the Garuda armor, which is 600. We'll have enough stuff to sell. Right? Kaza Kaza Bazaar. Very bizarre that Gorons are here. Uh, <laughs> but you know what? Screw it. It's hot. Death Mountain's hot. Uh, look what I've got. We have plenty of stuff to sell, right? Oh, yeah. Three Topazes. That's a lot. We'll just sell this opal and the ambers. Okay. Oh, yeah, we're doing good. Not gonna lie, the Zoro weapons kind of fit with it. It just has that, you know, that glamour to it. It's actually very fitting, not gonna lie. Spot plan. Get some nice temporary hearts. In the morning will be cool. Hearts are refilled. We have three temporary ones. So we can talk to Mini Urbosa in there and then make another beeline for the Iga hideout. Link short. <laughs> the Gerudo just like tower over Link. Holy crap. Oh. First Yigas. That's okay. Okay. Hop our way up. Shoot banana. Whoop. He didn't see banana. Uh. Will this work? It does work. Oh, that doesn't work. Oh, come on. It's still the sneak strike prompt. Clearly didn't work. I'm just trying to get through. Oh, uh, I see what we did wrong. We weren't a Zora. My bad. <laughs> Hit that. Now he's distracted. 
It's a better way to do it. You don't deserve to live. Free banana. Cool. Before he just ate that one. Jump up there. We'll just zoot it down. We have a lot of bananas now. Just like that. Okay. Pretty good. Then open the mighty, mighty banana chest. It was double mighty because it had its own chest. This is Topaz. Love my Topaz. Oh, we just kicked that open. It's funny. I like just stepping on him. Ruby. I love all the gemstones in this game. Wait, I want to try something. What if we actually... Oh, we can push him? Wait a second, what? Okay, yeah. Close the gate. Sure, what's that going to do? <laughs> the floating chest. <gasps> I mean, okay. It's not going to affect anything. I'm already here. <laughs> Let's open. I just want to see if it worked. Okay. Sneak 100. Yeah, so he didn't get alerted unless he was damaged. Look, keep that in mind. Do your thing. Come on. Simples. Pop. And pop. Pop. Okay, that worked. We good. Sword time. I like the Zora sword a lot, though. It's very cool. It's taking forever. Come on, Koga. Yeah. <laughs> I'd be early with it. Oh, what? <laughs> Someone you missed. Okay. The giant pit is going to be... It has to be like a dungeon or something in Breath of the Wild 2. Just given all the underground stuff, it's like, okay, that has to be something more. Thunder Helm. We got it. All right. Now we can head back and actually take down the beast. Oh, more lost Gorons in here. <laughs> That's funny. I still want just... It's all woman and Gorons. Divine Beast, Weapons, Ganon. Okay. Some good food lit the to torch, too. <laughs> uh, gotta make this attack boost food. Three minutes, 20. Let's make a few of these. Got more bananas. Yes. Okay. Banana party. Mighty Carp. Okay. With the bananas. Just all in one. Have a meaty attack boost. Okay. <laughs> or a fishy one. And might as well use the hearty salmon, too. That'll be helpful. Fish eating fish. We are cannibal. But superior fish eating smaller fish. So I guess that's normal. <laughs> All right. The Nabor segment is a bit tricky. <laughs> More bomb arrows. We used like all 20 last time on Windblade. But it's okay. Going straight in. We don't need Mini or Bosa's help. Get back. Get back. Get back, I said. <laughs> Usually she catches up just fine. Come on. There we go. Oh, there's a circle that uh, goes down to see when you're going to get hit. I did not know that. Wait, what? How did I never notice that? That is so helpful. Okay. Get the first one. First one down. That's good. Very helpful. Oh, okay, good. Okay. Going for it. I don't care. Floor soul stuff. Screw it. We got it. <laughs> it was worth it. We didn't fully die, but uh, okay. We're fine. Terminal. Kind of weave our way around. Oh, never mind. We got it. Turn this column. Just twice. Let's do it right away. And then uh, twice more. Let's go full circle. Do it really fast. Parkour God, yes. Link. <laughs> oh wait, we can kind of get our way on top of there. Okay, good. <laughs> Have to find a hook. We can do this, right? Just land on there, maybe? Okay, actually working? Kind of? Yeah, we did it. Oh, no. Oh, you're kidding me. <gasps> Time to spin again. This makes it all simpler. Okay. <laughs> Not bad. Okay. Eyeball. Get got. There it is. Let's get you down. Ah, no. No, no, no. We're good. It barely just fell off. Go Chompy. Yeah. Chomp. What? <laughs> chomp, 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 chomp. Chomp. Shield. There we go. <gasps> Got a game with the parry. Like that. Get the terminal. Easily this time. This guy's just going to annoy me in the elevator. Oh, parries work. Yeah, parries really do work. Yeah, stinger the crap out of him. Okay, let's get him down from there. There we go, that works. Now we move down. Okay, spin attacks though. Take care of these. <laughs> Holy crap. Anything's unexpected at this point. Ah. Break it. Woo, okay. Nice. Yeah. A long blade. Couple wax. I like how this takes stamina to push though. It's so heavy, apparently. <laughs> There we go. That's the final terminal here. Awesome. I guess it's Thunderblight time now. <laughs> oh boy. Save Thunderbite for last. He has a full 2000 HP this time. Swords are nice with the shield for the fights, but I'm going to use the Trident because uh, it has some really good damage for this. Attack up food ready. This shall be fun. 
Let's go at it. Oh, yeah, very fast. Okay. Uh, okay, good. Let's try to do the trick, though. Okay, not too bad. Better than uh, the nine damage spears. Can't really dodge it. Oh, oh, what? I thought we would have jumped over it. We were so close. Okay. We got that, though. Uh, as long as we get occasional hits, he won't regen. Oh, yes. Oh, man. I'm a little too worried now. It already broke only a third of the way through the fight. Sword and shield time, I guess. Just wreck through his health a bit. When it gets to halfway, though, it's going to be a lot harder. This is just training mode. Oh, wow. So fast. Still throws me off every time. But we're almost halfway, though. Come on. So close. Yes. Halfway point. Now, let's hope he doesn't regen all back um, in the next part. It's right there. Oh, no. Don't don't shock mine right away. You shocked it right away. Now it's going to regen it back. That's so painful. Okay. Come on, RNG be on my side. <laughs> Thank you. Good, good. Drain hell. Just a bit. Yes. Oh, no. Now he's going to go hell on me. Parry, yes. Okay, good. Whack him around a bit. Screw it. Get some extra damage. Anything at this point. Oh, that got me. No. We stole the bomb arrows. Don't regen your thing back. Oh, you... Of course you did. Oh, we can't parry that. Yep. Flurry, no! He double got me. Nope, the parry and the slash. Wow. Why are you so hostile today? Oh, look how much you regened. He batted me around like dead fish. Well Only halfway again, though. Why? We gotta keep getting this. It's about our last hope. Oh, what? What got it? So, everything chained, I guess? I don't know. Oh, hit his shield. Oh, wow! Wow! Just from the back there! Oh, that's how he's gonna be. That's how he's gonna be. No! Oh, wow! So fast! So, so, so fast. Throw it again. Yes, okay. No, 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 no. Oh, he threw everything he got at me. Mmm, we're so low on weapons. Okay, good. He's still regenning a lot, but... Oh, no. Good, I guess, so. Just break through his shield, I guess. Yep. Before he regens back fully. The beat down. All we can do. Ah, oh, yes. Extra damage. Eye shot. Yes. Okay. That's very effective, actually. Come on. Just break that shield. Take so many hits. Was that even worth it? I don't know. But his health is going down so much. We're avoiding all just his worst attacks. Come on. Please. 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 Come on, another eye shot. We just keep doing it. Now we're getting him to beat down. Yes, come on, so close. Yes, yes, holy crap. We just wouldn't stop chaining him down. Wow, that's so effective with the headshot. Oh, yes, this time fish beats zap. Once in a lifetime event. That headshot's so effective when the shield's down. I'm scared for doing Ganon though. After that, oh boy. All right, back in the domain. We're pretty uh, battle beaten here. We need to refresh and uh, take on the big baddie. Hello, Mr. King. I've come finally for the weapon, which is the legendary light scale trident. Yes, 22 damage for a spear. That's gonna be so helpful for the finale. This alone will, yeah, just towers over all these spears. Look at that, a chest. And inside the chest is a Zora spear with durability up. Okay, you know, I'll take that. It's nice because it actually has a modifier now. A silver bow with durability up. Yes. All starting to have modifiers now. I know late in the game, but uh, hey. Wonder what's in the chest. Hopefully not a long throw weapon. What? Are you kidding me? How did we get long throw? That's unfair. <laughs> I mean, it's still a silver long sword, but are you serious? How? <laughs> you know, I've actually never repaired a weapon this game before. And we broke the ceremonial. Uh, this seems like a, a weapon repair, man. Um, ceremonial trident, what do we need for this? Remake, Zora spear, and five pieces. Oh, okay. Well, we know that now. I've never done this before. Uh, well, there we go. Another ceremonial trident. That's awesome. Well, we have both of them. Ceremonial trident, Mipho's light skill trident, and a bunch of other nice assist weapons. And a not so nice one, but you know, screw it. <laughs> we don't talk about that, but wow. Okay. Three bows, that's gonna be plenty for Ganon. Full thing of shields. 
I think we're now ready to finally take our horse and make a way for the castle. Oh, and look who it is waiting for me. Hey, we're just about to call you, but uh, you're right. Wait a second. Wait, wait, what? I thought that was Hyrule Bass. No, wait, it's another sideways man. What are you doing here? I literally thought that was Hyrule Bass. Uh, no. Wow, that really threw me for a loop. Okay. Ooh. Hyrule Bass. Sorry, Strong. We will, we're bringing back another playthrough. That's for sure. This is it. For the fish, guys. No, even better. For Sidon. We gotta do it. I just like this too much. Like, these Zoro weapons look so good. Come with the horse so nicely. We're going for it. <laughs> this is exciting. A little worrying because of Thunder Blight, but uh, you know what? We got the double spear. Uh, Guardians. Nope. He's shooting late. Okay. Gotta get around this guy. Oh, wow. That was close. He's stopping. No, you can't stop. Go. Go. Oh, thankfully he delayed a shot. Jump over. Oh, no. Oh, not my horse. Only one way out. No, not that. My Mephis Grace. Gotta fly over. This is not good. Ah, I'm gonna fish out of water here. <laughs> Go, horse. Oh, wow. That was very dangerous. You gotta rush through the gate, too. The Flying Guardian isn't nearby. That's good. Oh, there's the Flying Guardian. A lot of lasers, but here we are. Okay. Gotta skip our cutscene. Okay, not the death cutscene. Oh. Something fired. Whoa! Whoa! Everything happened during that cutscene. Uh oh no! No 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 no! They're all coming up! <laughs> Run! Okay. Oh, just barely. Oh my god. The part that ruins speed runs, yep. We don't have any fairy wait, do we have fairies? We have two fairies. That's not good. There we go. At a parry yet. <laughs> Get out of my way. This is tricky. We have a little bit of extra stamina. Nothing too crazy here. Okay, up to the balcony. Have more eyes on me. Bad eyes. Uh, what happened? It parried and just <laughs> it all exploded. Okay. Huh. No justifiable reason, but screw it. We can get up here now. Oh, waterfall. Yes. Okay. Swim upwards. Yes. Okay. We can actually fight the currents pretty well with the nice swim speed. <laughs> yes. My peak moment. Waterfall swimming. Oh, that's not my peak moment. <laughs> yes. Okay. Waterfalls. Clutched it. Here we are, though. It's the sanctum. We can do it. Avoid the guardians. Mephis Grace still has, yep, a couple minutes. Um, gotta go attack up. This is it. Ceremonial. This is how we do it. I think we're finally ready. We gotta do it for Sidon's sake. Okay. Zora, Ganon. See if water beats fire. Woo! Okay, yes! Good floor to start us off with. Oh man, just trickle damage though. That's worrying. Nope, slime down. Oh! Oh no, the first land on got us though. No. Oh, no, another fairy? Oh, <gasps> he just shoot up both of our fairies. Are you kidding me? Okay, we got the parry though. That does pretty nice damage. Okay. Wow, that's a lot. No more fairies already. Okay, uh, uh, this is, this is going swimmingly. <laughs> as long as he doesn't regen, we have a shot. Slime downs will get us right away. Can't have that. Bomb arrows. Good. Whoa. Okay. Oh, that was so close. Okay. Uh, can't risk anything. Oh, wow. Badly damaged already. What? Get some few wax at least. Oh, that's not many. Oh, slime down. No, 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 no. Okay. Wow. Well, let's go in with our Zora Sword attack up. We're saving this for quite a while. Oh, wow. This will be nice. Yeah, look at that. Very, very good damage. Oh, no, no. Oh, so close. I was trying to bomb your face. Okay, we have another minute for the Mephis Grace recharge. That'll be our only buffer. These are all pretty much one shots here. <laughs> A little too close for my liking. There we go. Trickle damage. Oh, did we get him to halfway? Oh, we did. There's no way. We can do this. <sighs> yes. Bomb. Have quite a few left. We're good. Extra damage. Ooh, nothing there. Yes, okay, good. Free hits. Oh, it's what? Badly damaged already. Wow. Okay, well, only one more option, and that is Mifa's light skill trident. Okay. Okay, good. Good. Mifa's grace is ready. Yes. Okay, just in case. 
Woo. Had to be very early there. Oh, he was very off. Oh, no, no, no. It's SmackDown. Oh, he's regening. Oh, we have to get this parry. It'll be fatal. Yes, okay. That would have been really fatal if we didn't get that. Yes, nice charges. Oh, amazing. He's on the wall. There we go. Parry right back at him. Do some damage. Good. Oh, so nice. Parry game good. Okay, nice. Come on. Only has a bit left. Come on, please. We're so close now. Okay, back off. <sighs> oh, no. Oh, man. We got roasted. Okay. Good, good. Come on. This could be it. This could be it. Do it for Sidon. <laughs> please. Come on. We got it. So close. One more. One more. Yes, we did it. Oh my god, Azora with the Mifa weapon. Yes, <gasps> avenged Mifa. And wow, literally spiked him to death as a fish. How does that make him feel? I don't care, we did it. That was awesome. It was a bit of a slippery finish, but the Zora only run through was quite the success as we were able to power through some of the toughest moments in scale of victory for good. I'll spare you from all the puns now, but this run was a total blast to play, and I want to thank you all so much for watching. This marks the third theme run we have done for this game, with the previous featuring the warrior-like style of the Gerudo and the stealthy nature of the Sheikah, so feel free to check those out in the playlist above and below, and expect even more themed adventures to follow. But thanks again so much for watching! Feel free to leave a like and subscribe here to support the channel, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye!